And as he said, temperatures are dropping once again tonight, so all that melted mess is freezing up again, turning into another dangerous situation on our roadways. Yeah, we've been monitoring our roadways throughout the day, and it's just unsafe to drive tonight. We continue our team coverage with Local 15's Darren Singleton, who is in downtown. Now, Darren, you've seen this weather firsthand wreak havoc on mobile drivers. Oh, it's been crazy today. And let me tell you something. We just got off the interstate. We took, uh, Drew and I took I-10 downtown, and uh, we took off Canal Street on the exit there. But everything we saw approaching Canal Street was that black ice we talked about, solid sheets of it, and it was taking some drivers by surprise. They would get up on some of these overpasses. We're actually under one of the uh, overpasses leading into downtown. When some drivers would get to that, they're probably out of state, they don't realize they're here, and all of a sudden you see them hit their brakes, and you're thinking, oh, why are they doing that? It's so dangerous. So just want to let you know, when you go to work tomorrow, if you're going to be traveling tomorrow, if you're one of those people that has to go tomorrow, you beware, because it is is dangerous on these elevated roadways. Now, someone who knows that are the towing companies around town. We got with Donnie Mizell with Mizell Towing in Midtown just a little while ago. We're going to be talking with more uh, him at 10 o'clock, but for now, we ask him about tomorrow. He's had about 40 calls responded to today. That's a lot. He expects even more, or at least some more, tomorrow. Oh, you think tomorrow will be bad? I think there'd be a little bit, not a whole lot, but I did notice there are, there are a lot of cars left in ditches and left everywhere, and I think there they wasn't that much of immediate danger that the police and the state troopers are probably going to wait till tomorrow and when the conditions are a little better to get those out. So they've got to be moved now. They're going to have to be moved, yes. And then there are the people that will be driving to work tomorrow that uh, think the roads are good, and they'll hit that ice. And, and back in the ditch. Yeah. Don't you be one of those people tomorrow. If you have to go tomorrow, up until, like Derek said, about noon, it's still going to be icy. So remember those overpasses. That's the places we've seen tonight that are the most dangerous. We're live downtown just off I-10. Darwin Singleton, Local 15 News.